one as a rocket ship. Can't believe it. Thanks to our sponsors at Rugged Radios, you can go to their website and enter the code for a discount. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to TFL's original game show, Is It Faster Than a Ford Fiesta ST? And today we have an incredibly interesting matchup. We've got rear wheel drive versus front wheel drive. We've got turbo versus normally aspirated. We got top down versus top up. We've got four doors versus two doors. Nathan, tell them what we're playing for. We're playing for and grins. That's right, baby. Something to make you happy and something to make you move down the highway when you need it. That's right, Nathan. We're playing for and grins. By the way, guys, this is a game show. If you're looking for a real review, check out our Hot or Not series because it's about and grins. Let's find out what's under the hood. Under the hood of our returning, well, Fiesta hasn't been winning much, but let's call it our potential champion is a 1.6 liter turbo that puts out 197 horsepower and I need somebody to drive this bad boy. Mike, come on over. Good morning, Roman. Are you ready to play? Heck yeah, I'm ready to play. All right, and under the hood of the Miata, well, there's a normally aspirated four banger that puts out 182 horsepower. No, it's more than that. Nathan, come on over here. You're driving this bad boy. It's actually 181 horsepower, but what's one horse between friends? Yes, and it's newly revised, isn't it? That's right. Almost everything inside of it has been revised, and it now goes up to 7,500 to the red line. All right, well, let's spin the Wheel of Destiny, boys, and see what games we'll be playing today. Pre-spun! Mike, spin the Wheel of Destiny. Hot lap. No. Just leave it. Yeah. Everybody knows the Wheel of Destiny is rigged, so you have to spin it. Oh yeah, it. I actually have to spin it? Exactly, you have to spin it because that way you get drag race. Today's game show is brought to you as always by our friends at Rugged Radios. If you like these, you can get a discount on them just by clicking on the link below. This is a really fast car, plus 7,500 RPM. That's my red line. I think we should do one more. I think I bogged the start. No way! Wow, that little Miata is a rocket ship. I still beat you and I screwed up my launch. What the heck? It's a light car, super high RPM, and that engine is spectacular. But hey, you know what's cool? Mazda added more horsepower to the Miata. Good for them. They did, didn't they? You noticed now. Yeah. I noticed right after I lost. All right, Nathan, spin the Wheel of Destiny. All right, spin. Very good. Looks like it's Fuel Economy Challenge. All right, boys, the rules are simple. Three laps around the track. Highest, highest MPG, average MPG wins. So you're trying to get the best fuel economy possible. So no burnouts. You can burn out, but that's probably not gonna help your cause. You should burn out, actually. You should do that. No, it'd, be, it'd look great on camera. The yeah. wisdom and the sage of the 19-year-old. Yes. <laughs> All right, dude, three laps. Highest MPG wins this challenge. Okay. All right, uh, away we go. Nathan, top rust looks good on you. Damn straight. I looked a little aggressive on the start there, Nathan. Maybe turn it back a little bit. I'm trying to maintain under 1,000 RPM. 1,000 RPM is not a lot, Nathan. I'm maintaining 900 right now. Here's my problem. If I maintain the slow speed for more than another minute, I'm going to freak the hell out. Oh, that would be no good, Cake. 
Mason, at this speed, there are no end grins right now, so just keep that in mind. No end grins. <laughs> Hey Mike, how's puberty going? Oh, not so good. I can't really grow a beard yet. Oh, that's okay. You know what? The, the trick to that is when you get the little whiskers going, you color them. You use a little bit of hair dye. Now I'm trying to maintain around 1400 RPM. There's no way this thing will get good mileage if I keep having to accelerate to maintain some momentum. Forty-one point five MPG. 41.5, Mike, that's the number you gotta beat. I can do it. I'm gonna take a nap while you do it, okay. Go! I'm gonna try and do the same thing Nathan did and keep it under. I'm gonna go for under 1500. I've done this before. I think I'm actually pretty good at the MPG challenge. Hey, Mikey. What was it like to go through hazing every day? What was it like to go through hazing every day? Yeah, you're you're a college kid. I wasn't in a frat, Nathan. Oh, I get it. You weren't in a frat. One of the many reasons I just could never own a Miata is I need to have perfect hair always. So you gotta take that clip at least at some decent speed, come on. I am maintaining a smooth but steady pace. He's a salty little cracker, isn't he? Oh, I'm sorry, I had the radio on. Challenge is an art in patience. Stand by for fun. I am the very model of a modern major general. I am the 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 major general. I there is no honor or glory in winning this. What do you mean? I, I, it's just uh, really um, you know, boring. I may be a heavy guy, Roman, but I have a light foot. All right, well, let's go spin the wheel again and do something a little bit more exciting. <laughs> round and round she goes, where it stops. Only Roman knows. Only Roman knows. Oh yeah, look at that, hot lap. It is. Nope. This is not a quality wheel of destiny we bought, gentlemen. How do you think you did? That felt good. Yeah? I don't know. The one turn you were kind of... A little iffy. Yeah. Well, you went one. Is there an O? There's no O. Oh. But there's a 12. Ah. 0.67. Not my best time. 112.67. But maybe I can beat Nathan with that. I don't know. Only one way to find out. I'm going to try to keep this thing in second gear for a majority of this. It's 
I don't care if I lost. I think I got close to his time. All right, Nathan, how do you think you did? I think I got close to his time. You were close, but I fear not close enough. 113.52. That is a Woo! bummer. Missed it by a second, dude. Yeah, I could make that second up if I had another shot. <laughs> See this, Nathan? <laughs> I'm doing laps around you. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. <laughs> Some people are going to claim it's the driver's fault, and you're absolutely right. <laughs> it is. Thanks to our friends at IMI Motorsports, we get to find out which of these two cars is faster. If you want to come here and see if your car is faster, just click on the link below and use TFL for a discount on track time. Well, guys, there you have it. Another episode of Is It Faster Than the Fiesta ST. Keep in mind, this is a game show. It's just for, well, Michael, come on over. You're feeling mighty proud of yourself. I'm having a good morning, Roman. And Nathan... Tell him what he's won. Go to hell. Um, and you've won <laughs> and grins. Congratulations, you jerk. He won and grins. <laughs> As always, this is Roman and smiling Mike, grinning Mike, and Nathan. Go to hell. Saying thanks for watching and check out tflcar.com for more news, views, and of course, real game show reviews. See you guys next time. Ciao. And, uh, what language is that, Nathan? Espanol. Oh, Spanish. All right. Nathan, can you just keep singing while I'm doing my hot oh, laps God, so that I don't get bored? Don't. Hey,